Ooh, I am the ghost who needs board and I'm dead. I got hit by 15 cars at once. Ooh, I'm lying. Oh god, it's echoing. Hang on. Okay, sorry, I'm back about that. I'm oh, sorry, uh, there was a stream going on. Uh, Yampy's here. He will be in a second. He's doing things. Um, and we are doing Ghostwire today, but it's not quite Ghostwire yet. We were doing the Corrupted Chaos file prelude because um, it's the prelude. You know, it comes before. So, so we're doing it, doing it before. It's what a prelude is. It's pre. That means it comes before. Uh, so, gameplay. Is this the right gameplay? I don't know. My liking is horrendous. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Okay, it's got it. Yeah. Ready for me? Yes. Welcome. Oh. To the one, the only, Yampy. Think we can turn this? No, I'll take my Okay. Uh, hello, as I. So let's get into it. It's a I visual can, novel. Can you of hear sorts, can you, it? Yeah, it's not long. It's not longer. No. This is your stream. Not entirely. Just, just this just, bit. Just, just, this bit. A jewel, like quite. Okay, let's go. Okay, I am, I am. Hyped. Protagonist. Yes. Yeah. Hang on one second. Ah. Rinko. God damn it, Rinko. Erica. I actually thought this was really interesting. <laughs> oh, is this me? Am I gonna narrate? I'm narrating. Alright. Uh, <coughs> I'm ready. Um, no one wants to talk about it, but it's all that's on anyone's mind these days. Mysterious things are happening around Shibuya. Sightings, attacks, disappearances, fear. How is a kid supposed to be a kid at a time like this? But honestly, Ryota never was like most kids. He's not usually glued to his phone all day. Okay, so pick these. These are three stories. Use the stick and pick one of them once we've gone through all three. Yeah. I'm going for the most. Popular I think these one. these ones are going to be so. This one's the most popular. Unable to shake the idea that monsters are all around him, Ryota navigates on his phone to a document called the Marinouchi 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 Vanishing. The language is complicated, but he works to understand it. It says, I got a tip on a missing woman from Marinouchi. <laughs> when you've been a detective as long as I have, you tend to build up a big network of contacts. The story, actually, I know who this is. We're good, thanks. Um, I know who this is. You technically should read this. Should I? You should. It's okay. actually from the perspective. So. Uh, what kind of voice should I do? Just, just go with the normal one because you've got a lot of it. Don't, don't flog yourself okay. to death. The story my contact told me was that they saw the woman one day when the fog rolled in. It blanketed the area and then poof, she was gone. Times like these made me wish a certain somebody was around. Come to think of it, the fog and these disappearances set the scene for when I first met the rest of my crew. Everybody kept talking about folks just up and disappearing and I thought it was a load of horse. Poop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't till I met them, and until my encounter, that I believed. Ever since then, I've been haunted by what I, what I would have once called hallucinations. Turns out being able to see spirits and monsters isn't fantasy movie nonsense at all. Guess I should be thankful, because otherwise I wouldn't have seen that monster taking the form of the woman. I would have seen through that monster taking the form of the woman. <laughs> I can do things without you watching, you're fine. Oh yeah. She made a bunch of red orbs appear that chased me around, but I knew so long as I didn't let myself get surrounded, I'd be okay. She was a nightmare to look at, so I put her out of her misery. When I searched the scene, I spotted a woman's handbag, figured the, found the missing lady's ID cards in there. Then I came across some coals, clothes that looked like they would have been hers. They were in a little pile, but the way they had fallen made it clear her body had just vanished, like an old oak table. Thank you for the subscription, as I Once again, you're a champion as of the channel. You madank. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, know you very much. Do you know what a madank is? That's a very British way of saying you're crazy. You are. That's wild. Anyway, Thank here you. Here we go. 
No mistake in whose handiwork it was, either. I'd finally managed to get my hand on a solid enough lead to work with. There's Azai doing his boop. <gasps> Azai! A year! You did it! You, oh, you wow. hit a year! Yay! 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 Congratulations, Azai! Uh, I'd already used one. I'm mad at, I'm mad at. KK. It's, it's not fancy. It's what common people say. Yeah, it's the common people. Okay. Next one up. So we got these ones. Rialta concerns. Rialta's concerns bring him to a mysterious case file posted online. It's titled "The Kirigawa Ga Gaoka." The Kirigaoka vanishing. He reads to himself the best he can. It does not feel like a year at all. You're right. Time flies. Having tracked another report to the dark f of dark fog to the area, I arrived to find it had passed, leaving dreary rain hanging over the neighbourhood. At the scene, all we found were the clothes of a mother and son left behind like two molted cicada shells. It's hard to even imagine a parent and a child just gone. Precious lives snuffed out forever. My heart sank knowing that I'd failed to protect them. It was the worst feeling I'd ever felt, as if on cue the rain started pouring down. Heavier and heavier it fell with each passing minute, but I couldn't be bothered to take out my umbrella. That's when the obvious culprits returned to the scene of the crime. A group of monsters. They had umbrellas of their own, as if rain followed them wherever they go. I was furious. I brought hell down onto them at that very moment. They tried to protect themselves with umbrellas, but I just kept pe- <laughs> Pause. Pause. Time out. Time out. As I- <coughs> As I. Get off the mic. Are you mad? Get off the mic. <laughs> There's just a blowout. Ten. That is insane. Ten gifted. Ten. So congrats to Ve Vex. Got the names? Somewhere in Vegas. Jumping Panda. Rinkaku. Pigalicious. Uh, Cosmo. Uh, the Wrinkled Turtle. Hey. Uh, Spessim. Yeah, I think Spessim. Uh, Jack Henley and. Bird brain barstool for the subs. <laughs> barstool. Yay. Yeah, barstool. Back to the novel. That's insane. Thank you very much. That's that's ten. Oh my god. What a day you're happy. Anyway, oh. back to anyway, focus, focus. <clears throat> they tried to protect themselves with the umbrellas, but I just kept pounding on them until they were battered and broken. I was so exhausted I could have fallen over at any moment, but my utter wrath kept me going. As I picked up to leave, I still refused to open my own umbrella. I just walked away, rain pouring and soaking me to the bone. KK. And the last one. Could monsters really live among us? These case files say yes. They absolutely can, and do, according to this one. Oh, uh, where could the monsters really live? Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> this is a prelude to Ghostwire Tokyo, so this is this the visual is, box. Yeah, I should explain. This is the, when you pre-order the game, and you can probably get it for free anyways, it comes with a little visual novel that takes about half an hour, and then you get into the, the actual game. Yes, it's an action it horror. It is horror, it's, it's yeah. A horror game. Uh, if I... Hang on. So there's two. So there's this one, and I don't have the other one. Go along. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's there's these two. So we're doing this one first, because it, it's a good setup for, for the character, and it's a nice easy then. Plus I get to be involved, and then chance to get involved in the tech. <laughs> don't think it was a jump scare bit donations. I should have. Oh, well. Everything's a jump scare to Natty be rich. That's true. <laughs> um, a lady called me about a missing person who vanished from the bathroom of her apartment. Usually I brush it off as another runaway, but after seeing the crows circling above the apartment, I had a feeling there'd be more to this. The black stains on the front door verified my hunch. Turns out I'm the only one that can see these black stains. Okay, as I. Um, the lady who lived there and showed me in made no signs of notice in it. She showed me the bathtub and gave me a play-by-play -play of what happened. Her boyfriend was taking a bath, longer than usual, and so she went to the bathroom to check in on him. When she opened the door, her boyfriend was gone, and for a short instant there was a reflection of an old shrine on the surface of the bath water. I rubbed my finger on the rim of the bathtub and there was a transparent, sticky, slime-like substance on it. A reflection of a shrine's shone on the water's surface. I'm not going to talk about what, what substance <laughs> was on the bathtub. It's disgusting. I'll need to talk further with my team about this incident to see if these things ring any bells. I purged the back stain on the front door and then left the scene. Poor lady, what will she do now? What can any of us do? Okay, okay. Okay, so if you just press X. Coming on. 
In these posts, the kid had found something, or rather, someone, called KK. Has been looking for into some monsters in this part of town. A believer, just like Ryoka. Social media would never lie. <laughs> Social media would never lie. Never. And that means KK is an expert, maybe the expert, in all things paranormal. You can have a reading oh. bar. There's only one thing left to do. Oh, no. <coughs> no. Just normal's fine. No. Having no. poured over every story, post, and grainy photo, grainy? Grainy photo about local monsters he could find, Ryota prepares to take action. Okay, fine. I'm going to ask this KK guy to help. Just got to figure out where he lives first. Ah, Sagasu. <laughs> Sagasu. Oh, okay, it's just a... Oh. Hey, there's a game. Yeah. Bang, and it's that easy to find his information. Dear Mr. Investigator Person. Ryota Roots. Okay, so now we've got the team. Do you want Rinko, Ed, or Erika, or would you want? I can take them all. Take, take Rinko, I can take Ed. If you want. Okay. Dear Mr. Investigator Person, Hello, how are you? I am not good, and I, I am not good, and I need your help. Monster's got my best friend, Sasuke! Sasuke? I don't care. Rinko sits up in a chair. She zeroes in on one of the dozen monitors from across the makeshift command center, stuffed into this crammed Tokyo apartment. It happened near the manhole. Please help me get him back. Data files across the screen, seemingly too much charts and graphs, maps and mathematical equations, even social media feeds and open case files. Somehow, through all of this, or sorry, for all of those screens and all that clutter, Ryota's message catches Rinko's eye. Sounds desperate, but it could just be some bored kid trolling us. Calm and confident, Rinko insists on balancing compassion with scepticism in her analytical approach. On the other hand, that manhole is within the vicinity of several recent incidents. Maybe he is involved. Oh, sorry. <laughs> she knows what she thinks. But she also knows... What? She knows what she thinks? Of course she does. But she also knows no one can protect Tokyo all by themselves. Trusting your teammates is the only way to keep everyone safe. What do you make of it, Ed? Ed squints and takes a single deep breath as he turns to the screen. Oh, you are definitely Ed. That's literally his view <laughs> to the receding hairline and everything. <laughs> he has something to say, but holds it back. Technology is easily. Easily. Easy. Isn't People. E is easy. People, People are hard. Instead of speaking up, he places a small recorder on the desk. He presses play as the audio begins to roll. Ed turns and walks away. What? He's saying you're a better streamer than me. Ah, the ominous knows. Ominous no, me and me and ominous. We, we have a thing. I pay him secretly to say things like that. I've heard intriguing stories about so-called manhole girls in Japan. Oh, sure, that's one. Never mind. I've heard intriguing stories about so-called manhole girls in Japan. Vengeful ghosts of bullied students said to trick their children into following them into the sewer. Sewer? 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 You have so many bongo cat okay, emails. Tap, tap, tap. I swear that's like the sixth one I've seen. Right, <laughs> let's go. From where they never return. If any information turns up about such anomalies, I'd be keen to investigate, though I speak purely out of personal interest. It might not be enough to make the rest of the team pursue it without further evidence. Oh, we'll get more. Okay, safe to say, since you somehow found the time to record something this specific about a simple, single urban legend, that you want to look into it. Ed is already engrossed in other work. He doesn't respond. He certainly doesn't notice when Rinko rolls her eyes. He rarely does. <laughs> Probably best we have no idea how you spend your free time, huh, Ed? Eric has been sitting next to Rinko this entire time, listening and waiting for the right time to chime in. That time is... You want me to check it out? Enthusiastic. I don't think so, Erica. Could be dangerous. What if something happens to you? Seriously? You still don't trust me to go out by myself for five minutes in the middle of the day? At just 16, Rinko might be right not to trust Erica on something dangerous. I, I don't know why that sentence just didn't sit then. But Rinko knows that Erica has shown maturity beyond her years. She gives Erica an almost sisterly look of scepticism. Yeah, I could see the sister resemblance in. 
You know it's not that. Rinko quickly turns back to her monitors and away from Erica. But <laughs> for all her maturity, Erica can't quite keep from pouting. She doesn't look like she's pouting. She looks like she's about to falcon punch. Mm -hmm. Stop making that face. Besides, we've got our very own private detective in the vicinity already. I'll have him take a look. The stall is brimming. A wide array of customers eat re in relative silence. The only sound they make is slurping of their noodle. Now that is the kind of stall for me. <laughs> I like that the slurpy kind of... noodle stall. Yeah. There go. That silence breaks when a phone begins to vibrate upon the countertop. The owner ignores it, choosing to focus on his meal instead. The phone doesn't care about his hunger and continues to vibrate. How insensitive of it. <laughs> The phone wins, the peace and solitude have shattered. There is no way to enjoy noodles. Is this me? You might as well take it. God damn it. The silent diner finally glances at the screen. He begins to mutter to himself. Another case? These people have had me, uh, have me working harder than my enemies ever did. Good boy. This <laughs> is a dog. He didn't work. Can't even get five minutes to enjoy a nice, quiet lunch. I like how it says mumbles and you spoke that clearer than you spoke anything else. Mm -hmm. Let me guess, I'll be risking life and limb. That way you let it ring for so long, too scared to pick up? Do you want me to take KK? No. You sure? Yes. Okay, because you've got a lot of reason coming up. Huh, you know the exact day I'll stop being scared of anything. Well, oh, the day you stopped being a loner and hooked up with us so we could have your back. Sure, that works. Besides, I'm not full enough to pretend this team isn't half okay. You need backup, you know I'll be there. No questions asked. I actually already volunteered, but... Oh, it's Erica. But right now, there's nothing dangerous to be worried about. It's a simple check-in on a report of some suspicious activity that might be connected to these phenomena we've been looking into. <laughs> it's always the simple cases that go the south the fastest. You know what, maybe you're right. Maybe Erica should run point on this one. Sure she's just a kid, but you're busy, so. Whoa, hold up, let's not sacrifice the rookie to make me look bad. I'm already out. Send me the info and I'll get on it. First though, I need to talk to one of you about something. Okay, so you can use your stick and pick a person to ask a bit of a backing question. So who are you interested in? Who do you want to know about? I don't know. Ed, because I'll have to talk the least. Okay. Ed, I'm betting you have a file on this already. Got a file on everything. Funny you say that. I have files dedicated solely to listing subjects that I don't have more complete files on yet. Want me to pull them up? Just give me the highlights. Unfortunately, what I know about the legend of the manhole girl so far <laughs> is just, it's just that. A legend. There may not be anything else to know. It appears to be a story passed around by kids at sleepovers. Wouldn't be the first time something isn't supposed to be real attack me in a dark alley. If you're worried, maybe it's time you return to field work. Or I return to field work. When I wear my hat, I blend right into the Tokyo crowd. Funny, I would have never marked you for a Tokyo native. Then again, the place is absolutely crawling with tourists, isn't it? No. <laughs> Thanks for the insights. I'll take it from here. All right, so I'm moving on. Now, we've got a strange split. We've got Ryota and we've got KK talking. It is KK, by the way. <laughs> um, do you want to keep a part or do you want to do both parts? Uh, I'll, I'll do both. Okay. Ryota doesn't notice the people passing him on the street. They, own, they don't notice him either. He's young, but he's very much alone. Don't let the bald elf distract. He did. He actually did. His focus is centred on a small bit of paper in his hand. After a couple of folds, the paper finds a familiar configuration. With head, arms and a body it takes shape, a palm-sized person stands in his hand. As Ryota inspects his creation, someone who has been observing from afar steps out of the shadow. What have you got there? Ryota looks up. He's nervous, but clutches the paper doll in his hand to stay brave. He's not running or hiding, despite the gruff stranger staring at him. No need to be afraid. I'm not here to do anything bad to you or your little friend. 
gotta admit, I've been known to carry the odd paper doll with me on investigations. Strange habit, I know. But you get the benefits of a partner without the annoying small talk. Relch's shoulders ease. He lets his guard down as he listens to the detective and re-examines re the folded paper. The detective surprises himself with his playful tone. He's rusty but somehow still feels comfortable talking to this scared kid. Sometimes paper dolls are used for magical purposes. You a sorcerer by any chance? Now would be the time to tell me. Oh, so you really are him, huh? Gonna have to be more specific, kid. You're KK, the ghost hunter from the files. You must be. I just thought you'd be taller. Boss. Yeah, tell me about you. They say you solve strange mysteries, right? KK, maybe. The detective looks closely at Ryota's phone. He sees the social media posts featuring photos of various case files he's worked on, collected in one place. Look, I only use those initials for writing out my names of pain, and I got too much pain already. So hurt, on the inside. That's oh, why I smoke me. and drink scotch and eat. <laughs> not your problem, right? Anyhow, that's me, KK. But I'm not a ghost hunter, I'm a detective. KK's demeanour hardens a bit, dropping the playfulness. You wanted an investigator, kid. Well, you got one. I'm so glad you're going to look into the disappearances at the manholes. I keep forgetting that I'm both. I can take KK if you want. No. Here's the thing, I already did. Made some calls on the way here. There's no record of any recent disappearances. Still got a few friends on the first... For, for, uh, on the first... <laughs> on the force, so I can dig up dirt quick. KK shoots Rio to a serious look. You're trying to pull a fast one on me, are you, kid? It's true, honest. My buddy Sasuke disappeared. He hasn't come home since yesterday. Last place I saw him was right back here. Ryota motions to the alleyway behind him. He went down that way. I tried to follow, but I couldn't find him. He was completely gone. If Ryota is bluffing, he's an incredible liar. A sadness comes over him when he looks back towards the alley. KK looks back and forth from the kid to the alleyway behind him. All alleys are dark, but this one looks like it's never seen daylight. Hmm. See any fog when that happened, the moment he disappeared? Now that you mention it, there has been something smooth, spooky around. Smooky? <laughs> like a kind of fog or darkness. But it came and then went. Alright. Yeah, KK mutters something to himself as his eyeballs the alley as as he eyeballs the alleyway behind Ryota. Nothing looks immediately out of place. With so much going down. <laughs> With so much going down in this city, some kid getting lost doesn't exactly seem like front page news. Now, you can choose to call the kid's bluff, or you can ask for more info. Go with the writing, not with the picture, it's confusing. Yeah, I know. I need more to go on, kid. Why are you so convinced he was taken? Didn't happen to anyone else around here. But it did happen to my best friend. Sasuke has been missing for two full days. Everyone's been looking, but no one can find him. What about his parents? Have they filed a police report? I'm the only one who really cares about Sasuke. I know he needs me. And no one else is even looking for him anymore. Just me. He's lucky to have you. It's like when you saw crows circling above the building in one of the cases you investigated. You knew there was more to it than everyone else. Well, Mr. KK, I know there's more to Sasuke's disappearance. I just need your help. Really did your homework, huh? I'm impressed. You're more dedicated than most adults I know. You remind me of my friend Erica. She lost someone too, and she'll never stop fighting for them either. KK takes another glance at the alley. Alright, show me exactly where this Sasuke pal of yours disappeared. She's a deeper voice. She's been down there, yeah. Yeah. Real to picks up. Oh yeah, it's you, isn't it? So you're going to look into it? I'm here, ain't I? Let me check in with my team, see if they've figured anything out. Could save us some time. KK reaches for his phone. What's up? We're all here. I just need a quick word we want you to follow up on what the kids told me. Okay, so... You've obviously found the team about what's happening. Who do you want to ask about what's happening? What are we looking into? The manhole covers? The manhole covers, yeah. You've already exhausted Ed a little bit. He's told you it's just a legend. So what would you do next? Who would you ask? 
myself. <laughs> Just talk, you talk to yourself. Still on the phone. Still They're on like, the phone. who are you talking to? <laughs> okay, fine. On second thought, I'm going to go with my gut. My instincts are usually right. You I actually went for yourself? Yeah, I meant to talk to Erica, but then I forgot what I was doing. I just hit X on my thumb. Okay. Real time. I think it's time to find Sasuke. <laughs> Going down. <laughs> Nothing looks out of place, but things are rarely what they seem. JK slowly but deliberately reaches his hand out. He's not holding on to anything, but you would think that he is by the way he's moving. It's like he's got something invisible dangling from his fingertips. Ryota has no clue what he's trying to do, but he watches closely. However, what happens next can only be seen by KK's eyes. As KK opens his fingers, a sparkling orb of energy drops from his hand into the ground. It ripples like water in a still pond, energy flowing outwards into the world. Ooh. Wow. Magic. <laughs> Something is sus about that manhole cover. Someone vented? Oh. Someone manholed? Oh my god, he manholed. Sasuke is clearly the imposter. A strange trail floats into view, as though a spirit has passed through this place. Psychic energy. The trail leads further on, deeper into the alley and out of view. Guess he went that way. Puzzled. You went very solid snake. Guess you went that way. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Puzzled, Ryota follows KK's eye line down the alley, but sees nothing out of the ordinary. See, if, if YouTube is anything to go on, doing solid snake impressions <laughs> is the key to getting <laughs> big. the key. What happened? I don't see anything. Trust me, kid. It's good you can't see it. This is a power you don't want. Ryota thought that KK was schizophrenic. <laughs> okay, go. And you're too young for it. You take a risk like that and change your life forever. The world's a scary place. It keeps getting worse. We're going to find your friend and we're going to get you back to your life. Transition. What key do you press to hide cam? Is it that one? Well, no, in like two seconds when I check. Not that one. No, it's not. KK and Rinko are in big trouble this time, running like rats desperate to stay alive, with only a dingy old sofa between them and... Monsters! We'd better find another exit. Rinko turns to KK and sees him holding his head. He appears to be in great pain. Damn, it's happening again. Your body's reacting to the ether. Whoa. As KK looks at... Uh, this is my bit as well, crap. As KK looks into the room, his vision begins to break in half. He tries to focus, but rather than reform, everything continues to split apart even further. Another hallucination. The world's breaking in two. That'll be crystallized ether. Another form of matter. Sounds like your body's entered the final stages of affinity. <laughs> From thin air, like phantom, these horrific visitors appear surrounding KK and Rinko. Damn, we're surrounded. Nice, nice spell in there. <laughs> we're surrounded. Got it there, don't you? There's worse ones. Mr. KK? Uh, you okay? Okay. Huh? Sorry, kid. My mind can be a little hard to control. Okay, you okay? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> You kind of stood there for a little while. Sometimes my memories take me places. Dark places. Hate to leave you alone again, but you need to wait here while I look for your pal. Sit tight, won't be long, kid's dead. Deuces. Kid's dead. Back at HQ, a report on Rinko's computer setup flashes on screen. Ed's monitor software has a hold of something big. The results are clear, spiritual residue, and it's exactly at KK's location. Kid's dead. What is it now? We just received an alert. There was a massive surge of spurge of spinach 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 spinach. There's a surge of spinach energy at your location. Hold off until pursuing until we're able to send send support. God damn it! You fell apart then. Can't wait forever to you. 
I need medicine, I think. Can't wait forever for you guys. We might have a missing child on our hands. We've got plenty of evidence. I know what I'm getting myself into. It's not fair to ask us for help when you think you need us, and then use our own words against us when you're too impatient to act as a team. We're in this together. KK decides to address one team member specifically to make his case oh. as to why he should act now and not wait for the team. What Eric and I have been through. I don't expect everyone else to understand. Hell, I barely understand it. I'm not KK. No, I'm saying like... I'm sorry? It's a oh, what you've been through? Girl. Yeah, she's been through some stuff. What have you done? Here's what I do understand. I take risks so others don't have to. And yeah, you do all the same thing. That's why I'm proud to call you my team. But it has to stop somewhere. A line needs to be drawn. We are the vulnerable ones who need your protection. We're all strong and that strength multiplies when we work together to help others. You two are so special to me both of you. And I think I understand where you're both coming from. It's just a, this thing, this torment. Once that power's gotten inside of you, the infinity, it won't let you rest. They're being chased. We're running from something awful. I'm sorry. I'm not making it. I'm sorry that I'm not making any sense. I just can't be quiet right now. I have to speak my truth, and I have to support whatever decision he makes. The, the truly selfish act would be to stand still and let it overtake you. In the end, I know I would do the same thing. Hope you never have to. I'll talk to you later. I'm in the middle of investigating. I never was any good at following people's directions. That attitude of his is... That's oh, me. that's, that's you. Well, that's me, that's finally. You. That's you. That attitude of his is precisely what saved our hides on countless occasions. You think they don't realise that? Erica smiles, thinking about KK's attitude. It doesn't bother her. Keep looking at the bald elf. Damn, they're everywhere. KK's eyes dart between the two... I was reading it in my head. KK's eyes dart between the two horrific figures and some incredibly strange glowing crystals that hover over nearby. Hover over? Hover nearby. As he tries to speak, KK squeezes painfully. Rinko, what would happen if someone tried to touch one of those ether crystals? Your guess is as good as mine. Might give you the power to fight back. Might just make you even more miserable. Who can say? What about him? Didn't it grant him strength? Rinko nods silently. After getting his answer, KK, without hesitation, stretches his hand out towards the crystals. Wait, stop! Stop is an option, not for any of us. You don't know what'll happen, it could kill you. And those things won't. We're dead if we don't try something. We aren't out of options yet. You've thrown away everything to fight these monsters, same as me. There's not a goddamn thing left to lose at this point. Before Rinko can say anything, KK reaches out all the way. Everyone's dead. Dead. Everybody's dead, Dan. So that's KK's mind wandering back to a different occasion, obviously. <clears throat> KK follows the trail of psychic energy deeper into the dark Shibuya alleyway, away from the glowing, the glow of familiar streetlights and vending machines. His venture into the unseen brings him to a manhole cover where the spirit residue flashes with an eerie intensity. This is the spot. It's clearly the origin point for whatever spirit is at the center of this mystery. Did they take you this way, Sasuke? <laughs> KK looks around again. Finding nothing, he focuses his attention on the haunted manhole. The spectral vision shows KK a lot more than he thought it might, revealing the glowing spectre hovering in the dark and dreary place. The spirit of a man in his thirties. Oh, wow. Is that a Jibaku Rei? Mm -hmm. According to Japanese lore, this type of spirit is trapped in one physical location. Okay, Spectre, what's keeping you tied down here? Do you want me to tell the ghost? No, okay. I've, no, I've, 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 no, no, I've, no, I've, no, I've got two parts in the whole thing. Make sure of the dead. The Spectre seems unable to answer. Instead, he mutters as if distracted or perhaps completely delirious. Either or, maybe both. Spectres aren't especially concerned with politeness nor clarity. Neither of us is going anywhere until I get some answers. I need to know, what are you doing here? Specifically, this manhole cover. Why haunt this place? Oh. I... I thought it was a key. I was just playing... just a kid playing around. Having fun. Alone. I wanted to make sure he was safe. Ooh. So 
happens to be neighborly, eh? Yes, no, not making friends. Protecting, but he wasn't, he wasn't. Wasn't a kid though, was it? It was something else, something lurking in these shadows. Did I die? I think I died, but this isn't what I expected. What was it? Monster, monster. The spectre points downwards. It means in his pants. Yeah. Keke stares at the manhole as though he's just if he just looks hard enough he'll suddenly see what lurks in the darkness beneath its cover. He doesn't have he doesn't have to see the spectre nod. No, he's right. It went that way. Before he can pull up the manhole cover and see for himself, a long shadow creeps from the edge of the alleyway. Did you find anything? Snooping around his detective business. You don't belong back here. I thought I heard you talking to someone. Who is this youngster? Only I can hear you, so don't bother. <laughs> Only you can hear me? Well, sure, nobody else is even here. This is turning into a damn clone show. Kid, I need you to stay here while I go down. It's not safe for you there. Not safe, not safe, monster! But how do you know I'll be safe up here? My team's one call away. They'll get here quick if you're in danger. Weren't you just saying something about being in the middle of an investigation and too busy to talk to anyone? Funny you should mention that. Could I actually use some help. I believe they call it client services. Who are you calling, mister? Are they nice like you or nicer? Client services? Sounds more like babysitting to me. If only you would just wait for us to get there. We play the hand we dealt. I'm juggling work and childcare has never been my strong suit. I need a little support. Rinko sighs, a long, tired sigh of frustrated person, person who knows that in the end, of course, they'll help. She always helps. She will always help him, just as he will always help her. And I have the perfect candidate in mind. Who do you think could distract Ryota? See, a kid could usually be distracted by another kid, but I think Ed would be too boring. I think Rinko could be pretty cool, and obviously. KK's, KK's. You, Rinko, there's nobody I trust more. Which one? <laughs> Which one? The way you've looked after Erica, you got away with young people, I just don't. Talk some sense into this kid. Make him give me the space I need to get the job done. Okay. Put him on. Ryota holds KK's phone to his ear, happy to make another new friend. Yeah, Mrs. Ghost Hunter? No, Ryota, this is Rinko. I'm the, one, I'm the one who first read your messages about your friend Sasuke. We're going to find him. You just have to trust us and listen to us. We also need your help. Will you help us? We need a new deputy for our paranormal investigation force. A deputy? Like a real deputy? Yes! Perfect. You're now, on, you're now our official task force lookout. It's a, t it's a tough job and not, and not just anyone can do it, but I believe in you. I'm sending an alert to your, your smartphone right now. Every five minutes, send me a message and tell me what you see, even if it's just normal stuff. I will do my best. But you need to stay right where you are. If you go anywhere, that wouldn't be a good task force lookout work. In that case, I would be forced to demote you to a lower position, and you have no idea the amount of paperwork that'll create. You can count on me, Rinko. KK watches as Ryota smiles and hands the phone back to him. The kid puts on a tough deputy face and begins to survey the entrance to the alley. We're good. He's on lookout duty. Should keep him busy for a while. But you better proceed with caution. We're on our way. You're the best. Tell me something I don't already know. Now to get down there and find your pal, Sasuke. I'm trying to change it every time. <laughs> I know, but you've gone really weirdly deep sometimes and it's kind of freaky. <laughs> Sasuke... Dirty water splashes under Keke's feet as he makes his way through the still darkness of the Shibuya, su Shibuya sewers. Shibuya sewers. The further he goes, the darker it gets, but not because of any change in light. No, this darkness is unnatural. In fact, it's not darkness at all. It's tangible. Dense fog made of spiritual energy fills the air. Toxic, paranormal waste coats the ground and plugs the drain. But the air, the air itself is rejecting him. This corruption flows between worlds and reaches around him, blocking KK's way. 
How long has it been building up? Right below our feet. Is it like this everywhere? As KK goes deeper, the, is, oh, I, I'm not sure. You say Kigari, it's not a soft G, is it? As KK goes deeper, the Kigari only increases. There's definitely something here if there's this much corruption swirling around. Doesn't I can't handle though. Alone in the darkness, KK summons his power and. Hold it and try to check. Let go of X and try again. Oh. Whoa. 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 Okay, steady now. Steady handy. Oh. Oh. Ooh. 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 A bit wonky, but I think we got there. <laughs> Normally, it is like a, a straight spell. Cleanses the corruption, returning the sewer to its normal state. Really? It's a poof. Let the poof go. That's better. Minus the stink. With the Kedgeri now cleared. Kegari now cleared. Kedgeri. Oh. As if they were waiting for a moment of safety, someone appeared. That's gay! Is that you? That's gonna keep going, huh? The boy avoids KK's look, turns his back, and is picking at something on the wet ground. Uh. Splish splash, splish splash. Hey you, kid, you okay? Can you hear me? You hiding from something? Take a bath, take a bath. Come on kid, this isn't the time or the place. Answer me. I'm not trying to scare you, but you gotta work with me here. In the vast darkness of the sewer, the sound of KK's phone suddenly rings out. The tinny chime echoing back and forth around the hollow space. The small boy in the raincoat doesn't seem to notice. He must be very preoccupied. Raincoats and sewers never go well together. But it. I'm close. I've found Sasuke. But I'm worried. He won't. Down so far, the signal to KK's phone is barely holding on. He can only make out a few sounds and struggles to make out what words he might be forming. Hello, is anybody there? Rinko, is that you? Ed? Erica? Who is this? Who is it? Me. Uh, I want to say it's Ed. Ed, can you hear me? Are you Iriota? Can you ask him? Was Sasuke wearing a yellow raincoat? The scratchy connection makes it almost impossible to understand. Sasuke. Sasuke. It's Sasuke? No. Not. It's me? You're talking to Ed? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ed, I can't understand. Sasuke is not what? Not Sasuke. The call cuts out. The phone going dead in KK's hand. Damn. No screwing around, Sasuke. It's not Sasuke. Just like that, finally, as if called as if called by his mother to come to dinner, the child responds. He stands up. And turns to KK with his dead evil eyes. It literally just said not K not Sasuke. You're not Sasuke, you're the monster. KK raises his hand and calls forth energy and he discovered what? What? KK raises his hand and calls forth an energy that he discovered that day long ago. The day he found his back against the wall, reaching out and touching that ether crystal. Ever heard of ethereal weaving monster? Energy surges in KK's hand, green light winding and glowing, charging around his fingertips. The increasingly bright light glows, illuminating the tunnel. And in that moment, standing in the centre of the tunnel, we can see this monster, Raincoat Visitor, just in time for it to press the child's whistle to its mouth and... At a stranger's fingertips lies KK, now prisoner. And do you want me to do him? Yeah. I need my subject to remain calm, or nothing else will get done. Despite being captive, KK flashes the stranger a fierce glare. You son of a female dog. <laughs> Hello, my new friend. I'm keen to see how useful your vessel turns out to be. The stranger takes something out and holds it in his hand. An amulet, though clearly not simply for decoration, it surges with power. He looks from the amulet back to KK and smiles. So is KK not in his own body now? Flashback. 
As the monstrous little raincoat visitor blows his whistle, he steps back into the shadowy darkness. Running away, huh? But he's not running away at all. In fact, he's only making space. For two much larger, far more horrifying visitors to show up and challenge KK. I've been waiting to run into you again. Let's go, you barstools. Okay, so here's your attacks that you've got to hand in this particular situation. You have damage a single visitor with a wind attack, paralyze them, or block. Well, obviously no one's moving, so just give it a shot. One umbrella visitor is injured. An umbrella visitor attacks. What will you do? A barrier appears in front of KK. An umbrella visitor's attack, but it's actually deflected. But attack is deflected by the barrier. The barrier is broken. How many fights like this are there? This is it. Oh. The one umbrella visitor is injured. An umbrella visitor attacks. No. A barrier appears in front of KK. An umbrella visitor attacks, but its attack is deflected by the barrier. The barrier is broken. One umbrella visitor is injured. An umbrella visitor attacks. I need to remain. I need my subject to remain calm, or else nothing will get done. Oh, wait. You died. Oh, is that not intentional? No. I've got no health bar. No, you've only got so many shields. So if you just whiz through this, I'll tell you what to do. <clears throat> you just spam attack. No. Okay, so the fight starts. You can hit them. I'll tell you the pattern that I did to win this. Hit them. I didn't actually die. I didn't know you could do this. But if I tell you, I know what my pattern was. Okay, so one injured, one attack. So I block him. Bench the attack off. Now freeze them. Throws in place. Only one stun talisman left. Shoot. I'm just, I'm just gonna get through this fight. It's fine. Um, he awakens from the stun shoot. Two free attacks. And now you can block attack. He attacks, you block him. You shoot him. It's simple, really. It's just that you have to use everything that you've got. At least once. Uh, Barrier's broken. You win. One umbrella. Yeah, because when it says an umbrella, to, an umbrella visitor attacks and then you use the barrier, you're not blocking that attack. That attack gets through. It, you put the barrier up afterwards. You're done. The fight now over. The sewer is oddly calm again. KK sweeps the space looking for any clues that may be left behind. I wonder if we're mixing music here. We're not. There's no music in the game. But I can hear music. What, in the game? Yeah. Oh. One second. I can help with that. One sec. I didn't mean to press that actually, I meant to do something else. There you go. That's what I meant to do. Um it's on you, you can do your thing. Uh hang on. You can carry on. Are you gonna go mixed or warm? Strange. Yeah, this room's got it's very cold. Like like. Okay. Why would a pack of monsters manifest their evil here? But then he sees it, affixed to one of the walls of the tunnel. A wooden tag, sometimes called Kifuda. This must be what someone knows things. Kakei reaches out to take the Kifuda down, but his fingertips approach it. Dot. Rinko? God damn it, Rinko? Erica? KK feel uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I had a burp and a hiccup at the same time and it was like an in and out problem. Um KK feels a big quick thump through his body. When he looks down, he sees someone else's arm stabbing through his chest. Horrifying black smoke rushing out of his body. 
Looking back up, Gaga sees a man wearing a Hanya mask. You. As KK comes to, are you okay? Yeah. He realizes that in the tu he's in the tunnel once again. No, still he looks at his chest. Totally fine, no gaping hole, not even a scratch. Sweating, breathing heavily, his mind races. It was a horrible dream, maybe a vision. He grips the kafuda in his hand. Oh, I won't let him get away with this. Won't. I won't let him get away with this. So hard me, man. that it smashes into pieces. I won't let him get away with you, Amy, man. At that moment, KK realizes he's not actually alone. Who's there? Surprised, he spins to face the entity, but before he can raise his other hand. Ah! Dead. KK emerges from the tunnel to find Ryota waiting with the rest of the team. I recorded something that would like to share with you, you see. I've never been as comfortable speaking from the heart as others that are around me. Uh, the hell is up with Ed's, glasses on. No, Ed's proportions there? Yeah, he's, gonna, he's a short guy. So mate, don't hate him. Oh. That said, I'm no fool. I can understand what it means to show emotion. I know it's not something easily captured, no matter how sophisticated the recording. So I've deleted it, and now I will do my best to express this directly to you. I'm glad you're okay. Wow, Ed, that's deep. I mean, for you, anyway. Yes. Thank you for lightening the mood by mocking this moment of vulnerability. Anytime. All of my instruments, devices, and software tell a story. However, it's just that. A story. It's not necessarily the truth. It's an interpretation of the truth. Data is, of course, malleable. He keeps just changing his hair colour and his whatever. And height. And, and, the st <laughs> and the story that was told to me when we encountered this alleyway today was, I'll just say, rather grim. Sorry that I scared you like that. Can't do anything. Oh, there you go. Naturally, I prepared for numerous statistically viable conclusions. However, despite the numbers, what the numbers tell me, I've never made a plan for carrying on in your absence. I don't know what else to say. I'm flattered, I suppose, that you don't want to believe how likely I am to die. I have backup plans for my backup plans. You're not in the mall. But you are in the mall. Safely above ground, reunited with his team, KK turns his attention to the original source of all this drama, his young client, Ryota. You were never going to tell me, were you? Sasuke isn't your best friend. He's your dog! Yay! He's my dog and my best friend! KK steps back nervously as Sasuke tries to jump in his lap, wagging his tail. No, calm down, he just wants he just wants to be a he just wants to be pet. Jeez, who would have thought that such a tough as nails former detective would have such a strong phobia around dogs? Don't have to broadcast it, alright? Wahahaha, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Don't be scared. This guy loves everyone. Maybe you should draw the line at loving monsters and following him into a sewer. Ryota hugs his dog and gets a face full of licks in response. KK relaxes slightly, seeing how harmless the little dog is, but still keeps some distance. Thank you so much for bringing him home safely, Mr. KK. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. KK, what an adorable alias. When did you exactly go start going by this new short nickname, KK? I suppose it has a fun ring to it. Uh, not quite so formal as your full name. K we, uh, oh, okay. you, you, you. Before we get too sidetracked, as the lead investigator on this one, I've got some paperwork to do. Oh, you've got some paperwork to do, KK. Not sure what's worse, fighting monsters or filling out all these damn forms. Oh, it's obvious that you prefer the fighting to the paperwork. KK scribbles out a few quick lines. Only Ed can read them. Hey, kid, this is for you. Ooh, is it a prize for helping you find that ghost? Almost. It's the bill. <laughs> Ryota's face sinks as he's left holding the check. Lucky for you, today's work is pro bono. That means free. Consider this your receipt. I'm feeling generous right now. Ryota looks closely at the paper in his hand. It says, K 
case of the cursed manhole extermination complete. Okay. Leaning over his shoulder, Rick called it out an uncharacteristically loud burst of laughter. Oh, now I get it. You didn't choose the nickname KK. Sloppy paperwork chose it for you. It's a lot in this life we don't get to choose. Tell me what you like. Not like I've got any use for a real name these days. Definitely not one of my old names. Doesn't matter what anyone calls me so long as I find that bar stool. KK's gaze looks fierce, as though he's recalling a bitter past. Probably is. Reflected in his eyes is Ryota, who looks pleased to have received KK's autograph. KK's expression softens in response. That said, I guess KK is not so bad. Wafoo! I like the rave. Oh, there is that go. it? That is it. There is actually music playing right now, but I am going to use this moment for you to talk to stream. I'm going to check your sync as well. So you can go to <sighs> this one. So there you go. You've had a little bit of a setup. You ready for the actual game? I am, yes. Ah, I'm knackered. All right, that's going to do it. For <laughs> <laughs> not a chance. <laughs> This is going to be wild. Yeah, I know. On to the real game. Are we just going rave? straight to it or what? Yeah, I like the rave. I've just realised I'm wearing my spare glasses and they're horrible. No, they're fine. Are you, are you echoing it into I my I am mind? echoing it, but I need to check with the audio syncs, right? Because I tried to fix it the other day and I don't know if I made it worse. Okay. So, that's my out. I'll be watching. Goodbye. Chat, be nice. Look Jeez. after him. He's going to get scared. I am. Yeah. He's a bit of a coward. I'm sorry you want to because it's getting get dark. Yeah. Time to smash the PS5. I am. Right then, you ready for Ghostwire? I am. I've been very excited all day. You'll need to turn the audio back on for the Elgato and turn the desktop audio off. I will be mean. You do that on the next. <laughs> Don't want your kind drinks in there. <laughs> <laughs> Greg's wants you to pay for something, apparently. I refuse. I think, I, think, Wait, I think it was Helen ordering Greg's, I don't know. For real? I don't know. No, it just no. popped. <laughs> it just popped on your phone. A little like payment oh, thing app. with Greg's at the bottom. Okay, mean face. That's a very mean face. Uh I'm just going straight back to gameplay. I ain't got no time. I'm too Anybody avid. Got a chance there. Nah, I like being bald elf better than being me. That's well, pretty true. I'll check you on the thing here. Okay, chat. This is me saying goodbye and leaving you in the capable hands of your streamer. Um, I'm gonna go take it. I'm gonna be watching. You can you can actually shuffle this way a little more now because. Oh, I've listen, got... listen. What? Can you hear the game? Yeah, the music. Um, have you turned the gatos audio on? No, nobody can hear that music. Oh. There we go. And the Stop. desktop audio still happens. I'm the real streamer. The real streamer. Well. <laughs> All right, let's do it. I don't know what the button is to remove the cam, by the way. Oh, I don't know either, so you might just have to... Have I put it all in a, what's it called? Cam? Yeah, it's cam stuff. So can I just do that? Yes. No, because the, the uh, stuff happening is not in there. <laughs> I'll just leave it. I, I'll genuinely just leave it. I'm going to go performance mode and leave you to your thing. Hi, 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 I'll tell you hi, if the game audio is loud because it is really loud. You get the bootleg shoot version. If you wanted Yampy, you should watch Yampy on Twitch. Actually, no way. He doesn't do it anymore. I'm too busy. i got kids to raise. Busy schmizzy. Schmizzy? Yeah. Schmizzy. All right, I'm going to do you all a favour. I'm going to up it just a bit more than what I need. Yeah, because... I would. It gets pretty dark. Hold on. One yeah, that's good. It's good like that. Um, got yes, I've got a pre-order one. Yes, don't know what that is. Right. So hopefully, it should all go nice and dark and yada yada. Mind you, bag lights not too bright because it's not look bad in the game. I would, when you get in there, um, when you're on the crossing at the very beginning, up your sensitivity straight away. Hi, hi. Right, bye, chat. Oh, I'm excited. I've been waiting all day for this. Oh, I do chapter two. Okay. Yeah, I uh, I bought this. Um, I did.
This is the whole like everyone's gone thing. Yeah, I know, Yampi's always got an excuse. I'm here again in text form. Yes, you've been confined to the conforms of my chat now. You may not uh, you may not leave again until next stream. Next stream that you're here. Gas are down two percent. I think I'd do the same. ちょっと。大丈夫ですか?動かない方がいいって。今救急車呼んでるから。大丈夫か?怪我してない?なあ。全然電波来ねえんだけど。I need to move Cam to talk right with the food. Hey out.私が君たちを救う。私だけが君たちを救う。君たちの魂は純化する。来るべき世界の礎へと。すでに器は整った。それは魂の住むべきところだ。
the hell is that thing? Oh, this is mortifying. Pick it up. At all. あんた一体。おい、エコスだ。俺のもんだ。お前はさっき死んだ。俺が出て行けばお前は終わる。そんな。どうすれば。お前に選択肢などない。俺にしてない。いやだ。僕にはやらなきゃいけないことがある。<
られるみたいだな。The Warmer Craft crystallized ether that can either be destroyed with ethereal weaving or with strike attacks. Doing so will, will shatter the deposit and release a shower of ether. Absorbing either restores SP, the energy to perform ethereal weaving attacks. Oh, it's still absorbing ether, sorry. Defeating visitors will also produce ether. Okay. I understand. I like the L2 interaction button. That's nice. Wait, I just thought of something that I remembered. I just remembered. There you go. Now it's all the right size. You want to turn a young in number? Ah, so I have a timing of a runner. You're so young, I don't know. When he talks, I can feel it in the pad. Ew. For an XP, we'll raise the Keto Synergy level with his new powers. XP can be acquired by defeating enemies and completing missions. Gain the level will increase your maximum HP as well as confer skill spirit skill points, which can be used to unlock new skills on the skills menu. Okay. Gaining the Synergy level grants spirit skill points. You can check your current. Skill points and spend them in the skills menu. Note that block paths with various spirit skill trees requires Magatama to unlock. I need to do this one. Enables you to perform charged ethereal weaving attacks. Yes, Okay, so there's more attacks. It looks like there's three main attacks. Maybe more if these count. Hmm. Okay, there's perfect block system too. Oh man, I hate this. I hate this so much. It's just horrifying, you know what I mean? Bubbly market coming soon. Do you have old children's clothes that don't fit clogging up your closet? Or maybe there's just one too many bits and all bobs in your kitchen drawer. Or drawer. Whichever you might have, if it's not getting used, bring it on down and sell it. Let someone else bless what was your mess. Ah, well, that was never gonna happen. Hello? Materials. Uh, you can resolve health by in eating or drinking the soup. Wait, what was that button? Why? Yeah, triangle hold. Okay, I was right. I just can't do it right now because I'm. Oh, oh. 
エーテル結晶体で呼吸をしておけよ。<laughs> Worth a shot. Yanuki, I must. Nanta. What is that? I don't know what that is. <laughs> yeah, something's up here. <laughs> Jump scare me, why not? Don't like that one. That scared the hell out of me. Like, I feel capable, but I don't feel capable at the same time. There's something in here. And now there's another one coming. Bleeding heck, I hate this. See, I knew there was another one. You never ask that in a horror scenario, everyone knows that. I knew it was coming. Man. Oh, man. Are they gonna be like doll hands reaching through these doors at me? This gives me little nightmares, like. Is it really? I would never have guessed. Let's get to a room. This evil. やまん。素晴らしい。生きながら見捨てあちら側と接続された。まさに理想的な観測者だ。これで計画は完全となる。誰だ。Find the hide button. I did. Hmm. Oh, Kana. 
I just hit the I just hit the, the manual button. Isino Aww, poor Mary. She was so friendly. And yet, and yet, alas, she didn't. I didn't got poked, did? And she got taken. Ah, nothing was done. 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 一つだけ方法がある体をよこせ妹は助けてやる I like the lilies the flowers like it's a very nice place 無理にとは言わこのままお前は死に妹はあいつに蹂躙されるそれだけだ僕は消えるのかさあな祈れ妹はマリー僕は伊豆木明人だ<笑>今さら自己紹介かよまあいい KK だ名前は捨てた So this is KK? KK. The mist's a lot less pronounced on my eye now. Like it used to be a pitch black thing, but now. Rest in peace, Mary. You have been taken by the Hanya man. Manya. Orenio 
walking around, so I have a bang on door, not a yokai. Could be a yokai, but you know. Also, might be Dylan, not much difference. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, we're in the actual game now, we're not in the prelude anymore. Just got in. Aye. It's spooky. Okay, okay, hello. ちっ黙れ。え、体はもらっていいんだよな。約束はしていない。現に。He's still here. Oi, Uragin, now you're not getting tonight. My ego got your dive with Yogan at the day. Emoto, Tretta, it's no Ibasho, she died. I saw Moktino Tamini. Oh, I like it. Fun. Ja, so can you give up? I have magic powers. I can do that. And I can do this. Spooky though. Oh, I see a Beginnings. How's your Elden Ring going? That is coming along very nicely. The entire build's different now, and I just completed the longest quest line in the game. I think I'm going to come back in for the maybe the finale, or maybe the build up to finale and the finale. But uh, this ain't it ain't really a character that you'd recognise anymore. Same same stuff. But I don't think I even showed you Cassie since the globe. I uh, yeah, no midweek streams today or this week because I wanted to build up to a big stream for this. Like, I want it to be like a, whoa, you know. That's where are you going? Terraria is still going well. I haven't done much of it, but I think I'm basically ready to take out the next boss. So, whenever you're ready to join in, you uh, you can, and then we'll just go and take out, like, Thunderbird and stuff. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because you're drooping inside the camp. Um, <gasps> oh no. Okay, never mind. That's two days ago, but didn't get a response. Oh, my bad. I must, I must have missed it. Sorry. Yes. Okay, don't walk in the fog. So I'm at the hospital. Blocking immediately before an enemy attack lands a true or perfect what? Got him. That was fun. I like this. Oh wait, that's right, you played the card. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you meant you meant a response to thingy. Uh yeah, no, I am. Um, I did have the card there. Yeah. They sound like nasty zombies from World at War. <laughs> They're like Slendermen. Demon Slend Demon Umbrella Slend. De Demon Umbrella Slend. Demon Umbrella Slend. Demon Umbrella Slend. 
Demon Umbrella Slenderman. Got it. It only took me 75 tries. Is wow, my timing then. I tapped my phone as it came on. Hey, take a look at the statue inside the shrine. Hello? <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> we said we sometimes took paper dolls with us. See, with the bells fixed to a small rod, which are wrong by the Shinto shrine maidens as, uh, as they perform ritualistic cabaret dances. Wait, that reminds me. Database. Is there enemies? Can I get to an enemy database? Hang your man. There they are. Type of visitor born from the hearts of those pushed to the point of utter exhaustion by their work. They apply an equally exhaustive approach to their work, robbing the living of the life of something something. Ooh, look at that, that's nice. Okay, I was checking. Okay, we're still trying to take a... Oh, okay. People! I can do this. I got gotcha. you. さっきの形を使ってみろ。イエーイ。吸い込まれた。うまくいったか。あとは近くに公衆電話はないか。今時そんなものいいから探せる。I'm gonna go and try and see if I can keep like capturing some spirits. Frog over there. Moola! If you explore Shibuya, you may occasionally come across shining yellow ether crystals. They are all wood, use valuable, make it with shattered, so be sure to take advantage of them. Okay. Hey, Kurumba. Not, not for me. Okay. Well, we filled up a couple of spirits, so. There's some more in here. Can't go there. Give me that beautiful phone booth. Is it down this dark and dingy alleyway? Oh my god, you can just... I'm dying again. I <laughs> <laughs> 
余計なことを私だけが彼らを救えると言ったはずだ邪魔をするな誰も救えない<笑>邪魔するなだとなら渋谷中の霊を集めて邪魔してやるよ。Okay. Hello, can I see? You can see you. Hello. What a good boy. Special devices are scattered to attribute hidden inside ordinary telephone booths. There are actually machines that transport the spirit to absorb to the cashier safely outside the barrier. A friend of Kaka's named Ed awaits their arrival and will help bec them become living humans once more. The more spirit you send, the more XP you'll be rewarded with, so try to save as many of them as you can. So Kaka dies in the end of the last one, then. Where you be, baby, 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 baby. I'll we'll brave the frog for a couple of seconds to get up here. Oh. I could have not braved the frog and got to the same place. Edot the Hitoa, Dokoka de Ikternoka? Sono Yoteda. Otondo no Kotoma Sote Naida. Oh, not Terkawagara. Oh, wait. Watching me then, huh? No? Okay. Come on then, let's get you out. Sleepy time. Shop. I got lots of good stuff. I could trade you for it. Have a look. I like it. Katashiwa. Mm, why would I buy them if they do nothing different? I'll buy three. Thank you. Wee ba doo ba doo ba doo ba didn't even notice that that was fog. I 
ってで。中に何があるんだ。あいればわかるよ。いや、それは、それは、それは、A report written by KK regarding a number of disappearances that took place near a manhole. <laughs> Put the utensils away, throw out the empty food containers, get the kitchen cleaned up before I get back as well. Is that your book? Yes. I've seen a book あんた、子供の頃から普通じゃなかったのか。え、that's the logo to the people who make the game。おお。向こうの世界の食べ物だな。俺たちなら食えるぞ。この世の食べ物とは違う効果があるのな。Food from the underworld. Not only restores your health like everyday food, but also grants you a temporary boost to your abilities. The remaining duration of food item effects shown in the game is shown in the bottom left corner of the screen. Good to know. Nope, not that one. Here we go. Season of Hyena, I took a kid kind of kid. So my mom eat up. Kid kind of kid, you forget about kid. Kid kind? ただ、このどっかにあいつがいる。お前の妹もな。That's Not that big, we'll probably just bump into him somewhere. It's probably on the top floor of the building or something. Just like go from roof to roof. It's not that difficult. It's going to be predictably on a roof. They're always on a roof. Ooh. What we got? Oh, wow. Is that a bow? What <laughs> こんなものどこだ。職業柄、まあいろいろつてがあってな。あんた何者なんだよ。国の番犬かつあぐれ者のお友達ってところか。どういう人間かは知らないけど、あんたがまともじゃないってことだけは分かったよ。Got a point there. Hey, this is the room. This is where Erica and everyone is. Dare Nakamada Rinko Ed. That that to you, Vic. I saw Ubago to Tameravana. Or that you saw our big doctor. Tataka Titanoka. Connoist that so is Sony. What happened to him? Are they all dead or? Buki mo chotas dekita shi. Soro soro iko ga. Then you can. Kekai da to. Mansion mo to oshitsugu suki ka. Kekai o yaburu hongo ga aru hazu da. Sagase. Kekai no kaname da. I'm 
何が起こってるんだ結界のせいであのような干渉が強くなってるこのままじゃあのように押しつぶされる。Tense. Oh man, another house. Okay, come on. God, I'm stuck. It's such a massive run, and then you realize he was just looping the same couple of rooms. I'm doing this. Easy. Spectral vision power again. I forgot. There it is. I don't know how to do it. 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 What's that over there through the wall? Well, Maybe it's a Nee. 
I both see and don't see his point. Oh boy. I can't believe I keep just falling down. I'm sorry. Ah. Okay, it's okay. Don't be in a bad mood. Can I pet it now? I'd stay there, but I don't know if that's DMCA. getting a lot here. Ah, over there. Yay! That's good. I like these collectibles thing. They're so very casual. Climbing is still a bit jank. Oh, man. oh yeah. It's right there. Yeah, we're in a minute. Hello. Come here. Are you a bad guy then? Hmm. What's angry at me? Oh, you're angry at me. Hello, Tengu. Could they matter? Kiriga Kieta. Ah, Taske or Motomeru Lay no Koya Kikoya. Okay, so the further you go, okay, 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 okay. Whoa, wow, that just changed a lot. Okay, so we're 
つまりあいつに嫌がらせができるってことだいいことだらけだおまんびっくりした死んでも落ちるのは怖えんだよごめん Can I get back up via the, the tank? Oh. I'm gonna see if I can get back up via the Tengu. Okay, I'm back. It's a little disorienting to do that grapple. Okay, you're bad. I've got to hold it. That's what I'm screwing up. Whoa, it's really weird too. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's too high up for me. Okay, looks like them stairs are our way back up. Because I feel like I am supposed to be up there and there's a lot up there. Oh. There's so much to do around here. Oh hey, enemies. Yeah, explosives. Oof, nasty grab time, but hey, I got him in the end. Oh, got it. Too soon. Let me up. Thank you. Okay, so you can glide from a jump. Yeah, you do feel pretty fancy doing all this stuff. Like, manoeuvring the rooftops is super fun. Like, that's probably one of my favourite bits so far, is doing all this and getting these spirits and, you know, trying to absorb them and save everything. I want to know what happened with Ed and everyone. Some otherworldly food, you love to see it. Alright, where am I? Okay, we got one there. A lot of crows over yonder. Grapple back down to here. 
Contemplating the best way to get up over there. Okay, so you have about five seconds of gliding, I'd say. Maybe even less. I'm gonna, uh... See, I'd love to just, like, put that, that crow circle in the building thing aside. That's a bit important, if you ask me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and make my way over there. Yeah, Yampy, this this is you. This is all you. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get back up here. And parkour too. A lot of parkour. You can basically do anything up here. <sighs> Got it. Gotcha, newspaper lady. I don't have the Katashiro for you. Katashiro? Katashiro? Oh, the crows are surfing there. Oh, buddy. Okay, that's just kind of reset all our progress in one fell swoop. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, yeah, it has. We're all the way back over here. New I could hear a tango. Come here. Come on, you can you can Come on, you can make that. Come on man, you can make that jump easy. Easy peasy. It's not that high up. Oh come on man. Uh Yampy's done like the first mission, but it came out today, so he hasn't had much time to do it. Oh here we go. So the crows are chilling here. Why so? Should have gone to the farm box. I give you some food. Thanks for the food. Yes! It's okay! Good boy! You need anything? I love dogs. Each give me some cash. Heckin' Good Boy Simulator 2022. <laughs> I just have random thoughts. Hey, -o. yes. Mary is in trouble. We need to save her. Was the crow circling? That's what I'm saying. Oh. I try and get back up onto the roof to have a better view of it. Because this is a thingy's apartment. It's KK's. What happened to KK? Too. I need to know. I think that's Dylan hanging on the door. Either that or I'm about to disappear in some funny looking mist in a second. Don't know. Come here, you. The 
pair of guys compels you. Hi Total on the air, many enjoy during New Year celebrations. Cool. I can't see anything that looks crow circle worthy. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, look, just get me up there one more time. Yeah, it's going over two hours. Hell yeah, I'm going like six hours. This is going to be another Tomb Raider stream. Okay, maybe not six hours. Maybe that was a bit over exaggeration. But I'm going to be going for a while. Uh, let's... Okay. Okay, so I can teleport to shrines. Okay, so you can cycle around them, that's nice. What am I missing here then? One Magatama, two Jinzo statues. Okay. May I still try and head there? Okay, who am I going to take these out? How many of you is that? Two. The lack of head makes it hard to tell which way to place We can do a speedy recovery. got that one then too. Come on, come on. Just come quickly. Come quiet there. There we go. Fight. Where's your call then? There you are. Come on, man.
God damn it! Maybe another 24 hour. Oh god, no. No, not one of them again. Oh, I may as well just clear it like I can't you know. Like, uh. Yeah, sure, 200 XP is not, not something to, to think of. I think I, I think I can get some new stuff. I think I just leveled up. Skills! Oh, inventory. Ah. <gasps> I'll be able to change how I look. Oh my god. <laughs> I can look like that, Anya. Yeah. I could change to look like a biker. What the heck? In gold? Why would I? Oh wait, I can change my... Okay. Give me the black boots. The black jeans. Black jumper. Oh, I've got to actually select it to change it. No, I haven't. See, now we're starting to get into the meat and taste of this. See, now how do I look? I need to see. Oh yeah, look at that, that's clean that is. Okay, what we got? Okay, that could be good. Eh. That could be good. Hmm. Oh, that could be good. Ooh, I would like that. I got 50? Okay, give me that. Give me that. That's good. Okay, so now I can actually deal damage with them. I wouldn't mind a better... Better glide, to be honest. Could have done more of these, but I'm not too fussed about these right now. Well, that would be quite cool. How fast does it get? Damn, you do it really quick, huh? Jeez. And then those I haven't got yet. Oh, I wouldn't mind getting that fed up too. Oh yeah, that feels a lot longer. I just punched the car. That's a side quest, is it now? Alright, let's have a look. Let's just have a look to see the side quest. That's a lot nicer. Yeah, I like that. Yes, demon food. Dog food. No difference. Hello, what can I buy? Okay. Yes, demon food. So when you eat, it does increase your max health, like, slightly. Oh, well, we're stopped. Old man concerned about water is his name. たまった情念はやがて汚れとなる奴らを生み出す。放っておくわけにはいかないね。水がたくさん溜まってるとこ探してみるか。そうだな。この辺りだと。
Three thousand. Hi, so I'm rich. Still water will probably pool on floor level, I'd imagine. Is it's oh is it here that I need to go? Okay. Up yonder, okay. Hold on. Yeah, but you can feel the slight tenseness in the trigger. Can I clear this? No core? No, okay. There's Tengus on like all the roofs, are you serious? I never knew this. Come here. Come here. That's so fast now, that's mega convenient. Where are we going? Places with lots of still water. The climbing's kind of intuitive too. I'm going to use this to get up here and then glide down. See if I can get an aerial view on where I'm supposed to be going first. Okay. Oh, buddy. Yeah, I can glide for ages now. Yep, you are. You're being absorbed into some paper. Lots of still water. We're looking for lots of still water. I think this is a more literal puddle, puddle than a, a spooky one. Long range, hey. Oh! It looked at me! Why do you want to sometimes not jump? Mega weird. Gotcha. I don't know where to go. Still water. I need to find still water? Where would that be? Well, now there's, there's moving water everywhere, but I'm looking for still water. Oh no. Come on, still water. Pulled up. Lots of it. That's all I need. Ah, bathhouse. Near the yak is a buff. Kill you? I'm not going to hide in the Hajimeter. That's very bright. Yana Kiha, you sir. Kigarena, you don't de Kukamo, you got it in the. It's a fight.
destroys that fast now. drink oh man that was a hell of a fight fun as heck but a hell of a fight all of that just to open a door into a bathhouse <laughs> we found coffee milk Guess that was a falto. Century so, yeah, it seems that way. Ooh, money. Yeah, we appear on gliding to my marker. Where we drop him, boys. Oh no. Ah! Uh no fall damage though. <laughs> Thank you, living grappling hook. Oh, it's you. Large shrines are actually where we have multiple Tory gates that have been corrupted. Cleansing all the Tory gates that are giving trouble, clearing the fog in the surrounding area. Uh, cleansing the large shrine has many benefits. Okay. Perfectly enough. Oh, I guess I had one too many. Never mind. Okay, here's a quick Tory gate we could cleanse. Pre-cleanse. Your friend. Gotcha. Oh, 
one missed the point. Like the fighting's really fun, but actually kind of difficult. It's a bit of a challenge. Another watermelon. Nah, man. Nah, I'm calling cheating. Hang on. Give me my health back. You didn't heal me. Give me the Tory gate and cleanse it, god damn it! Ugh. Another heal. Thank you. Hey, oh, free cleanse. Did it. Oh, that's what the the crows were circling around for. Okay, hell yes. That's something I'll take any day of the week. Oh wait, I can like... Okay. 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 Yori Michi Shita Kaiwa Atana. Zigiba Jofu Atmer. Shibuya or Miwata Silvacho Naika. Kagiri and Otembo Dai Tokawa. Bart Night. It's essentially a grenade launcher. I'd rather just cycle with R1. Ed? Hello. Hi. Hey, boy, I was over here. You understand me, right? Fantastic. It's fellas. I can see you ain't just some run of the mill chump, so let me lie something on you. Me and my crew came here from some motor to take in the sides, then all hell broke loose and we got separated. I get him myself, my back's being a real pain in the back. Can you go hunt him down for me? I'm being to look, they've shape shifted into something or other. But I'm sure you'll find them. Once you do, tell them to get their furry butts back to the boss pronto. Hey, hey. Oh my god. Hey, 
Hey, is one and dad down now? He's Okay, I think that's going to do it for today, folks. So thank you all very much for tuning in. That was absolutely amazing. That was probably my favourite thing to do. I really enjoyed that. Um, the fighting's really fun. The the game, like the actual gameplay itself, the, the running, the slightly more realistic camera movement and things. Like where you can't just look one way and then immediately click to look in the other. Like you can't do that in real life. You've got to have a second for your head to move because obviously your head's got weight. It's not just a... Yeah, you know, I can't do that with my head. Like I can, I can shake my head, but I've got a, I've got a weight to it, so I can't just do everything instantly. And that kind, the game kind of reflects that in the camera. Really well done. Combat's really fun, really intuitive, and it feels so nice to like bang, 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 bang. You know, as you blow, blow the enemies up and you pull their cores out. It's so fun. Really good. If you do have the, the funds, obviously it is new, so it's still like full price. Um, I highly recommend it. It's really good. It's really good fun. Um, no, I'm not sponsored. Bethesda. 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 So, yeah. Thank you all very much for watching. But for now, stay safe. Be you. Peace. Okay, I got the right one. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, wait. Wait. There's no... They're not doing the music today. Sorry. There you go. Peace.